I never thought I'll take 10 years to build a mine, and I did. Um, but the best thing that actually happened was that suddenly I had a voice. Suddenly, I could decide that I want the head of Sinta plant to be a female, you know, the head of the operation plant to be female. You know, I want 50% women when we do our bulk ethics. I want this, I want that. I was able to do that because I was in this powerful position. And that's what actually drove me to Kalahadi's success in terms of women in mining in particular. We are blasting, we are drilling, we are producing. The MRM, uh, the scheduler, people who actually tell people what to do on a daily basis are female. With 16, 17 years experience in the mining sector, geologists, mining engineers, and, and, and I'm very proud that suddenly I can see that they are there, they are capable, black excellence, black professionals. And, and, and for me, I want to focus on it because BEE is black economic empowerment, but there's also the other element of black economic entitlement, where people would come to you and say, I'm black and therefore I want to sell diesel to you. Whoever you have, it's okay. For me, it's not about that. For me, it's about being focused. For me, it's about doing, scanning the environment and saying, it's, you know, easy come, easy go. It has to be, have an element of sacrifice element of hard work, element of focus, element of sustainability to say, how do I sustain this thing? You need to look 20 years from now. I don't think for today. I think what will the mind be in three years, in five years, in 10 years, in 20 years, the sustainability, whether I'm there or not, because you want it to continue to do what you want to do. The number of jobs that you create, um, the multiply effect in terms of the economy of the country, the economy of the local people, but also the economy of the province. And for me, it's all those things in one to say, a good leader will have to look at some of those things.